What time's morning? Okay. <laughs> That's not a question that I want that I wanted to dive into, all right? 10 a.m. is the morning for me. Rise and Shine Canada, my name's Victoria Stewart and I'm Director of Beverage Innovation. We're here in the test kitchen and I'm here with Moose, content creator and DJ. In your world, you must meet so many interesting people. Mm -hmm. Any stories that stand out? My favorite people to interview are the ones that I just get randomly in the street. They usually have the funniest personalities or the weirdest, quirkiest things to say. So what's your icebreaker to get the conversation going? There's a few tricks of the trade that I've learned. I guess the first thing that I would come up to you, it depends, if you were like this by yourself, I'd go like, hey, how's it going, how are you? Listen, love this, black on black, but I wanna know if I could take a quick minute with you to do an interview. Depends, what's the interview about? It's super easy, I'm just doing a spelling bee. <laughs> I don't know if you're good at spelling or not. I'm definitely not good at spelling. Even better. People are gonna be even more entertained. It'll be great, it'll be great. It'll, we're doing high school, university level, it's three rounds. You'll definitely get the first word. I rely very heavily on autocorrect, just saying. You and me both. <laughs> so maybe you can even ask me a word afterwards. Okay. Cool? Yeah. Dude, I just, <laughs> look at that. I just secured another interview. It was that easy, guys. It's that easy. What's your favorite drink at Tim? Ooh, that's a good question. To be honest, I'm a big white hot chocolate fan. It's, I've loved it ever since I was a kid. And being a drink expert, I assume that you probably have a whole concoction. Well, being a drink expert, I don't stick with one thing. Okay. So it might be a latte, it might be straight brewed coffee, or even a cold brew. I like to change it up. What's your story? Where did you grow up? I was proudly born in Regina, Saskatchewan. Um, although I was raised most of my life here in Toronto, I'd like to think that a part of my Canadian identity comes from the fact that I was born out west. I'm a very passionate Canadian, and even though I never played a game of hockey, I love the sport, you know, deeply. And then when it's music artists that are Canadian, I just find even more reason to be supportive of them, or if they have a connection to Canada, you know, being born here, I just feel like there's been so much opportunity that's been afforded to me that a lot of people don't have. So I think the best thing for me is just to always be uh, proudly Canadian. And being born in Regina is definitely part of that. Regina proud. Moose, it's been great talking to you. I've loved having you here in our innovation space. So I just wanna say thank you. It's been so exciting learning more about you. Cheers. Thank you, I appreciate it. Cheers. Mm. Yeah, that'll hit the spot. Thanks Canada, love you. Ha, ha, ha.